pandas unique. So you're going to use pandas unique when you want to find the unique or distinct values within a column within your data frame. This is used for uh, if you have a very long data frame and you want to know what values sit within it, pandas unique will tell you what it is. We're also going to run, run through an example where we iterate through these values and then do something with the result. So let's check this out. First thing that we'll do is we'll import pandas as PD. And then I am going to create a data frame. Now this data frame is going to be a list of uh, restaurants and bars in San Francisco. And I have three columns. I have name, I have the type of establishment that it is, and then I have the average bill. And what I want to do is I want to find unique values within name and type so I can understand what the distribution of values is uh, in there. Now, you'll see here that what I can do is I can call dot unique. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to call out the column in which I want to pull the unique values. I will call dot unique, and then it's going to return to me a list of the distinct or unique values within that column. I'll go ahead and run this, and you can see here above where Foreign Cinema appears twice, Liho Liho once, and then Square and 500 Club appear a couple times. Here we just get the distinct values that sit within that column. Now we could do that same exact thing, except what I want to do is I want to call on the type column. And let's see what the distinct ones are here. Well, it's just restaurant and bar. Now let's go through an application of this in the first place. And so sometimes what I do for this one is I will, uh, I'll look at my data frame here and then I'll iterate through the unique values. I'll subset my data frame just for those unique values. So I'll say, hey, I only wanna look at the foreign cinema rows or I only wanna look at the Liho Liho rows or the 500 club rows. And then with that, I'll do some transformation on top of the data. So let me uh, show how to do this. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna call the unique values of name and I'm gonna store that within a variable unique values. I'll run this and I'll print it out. And you can see here that I have these four unique values from the data frame from up above. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do, do a for loop. And so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna say for resi, which is restaurant, in unique values. So for each one of these values right here, I'm gonna create a, uh, a single data frame or a data frame that's one of the single restaurants. And so I'm going to say, hey, I'm gonna filter my data frame for where the name equals resi, and then filter my data frame for that and store it within a single value here. Then I'm gonna print out your total bill for the restaurant that you're on is the data frame that you have with the average bill, and then I'm just gonna take the sum. So this is the total bill from it here. I'll go ahead and run this. And as you can see, I first went through foreign cinema, and I summed up the total bill, then Liho Liho, then 500 Club, and then the square. Now, there's a couple ways to do this. Here was just for demonstration purposes to show you that uh, one technique to iterate through the values of a data frame. And that is Pandas Unique.